The Mayas Mesoamerica is the name of good old Mexico, as per the historians. 200,000 inhabitants alone get settled here for the first time in this huge land mass. These indigenous tribes were known as the Mayans, who ruled the place for more than six centuries. Since 280 CE to all until 900 CE, the rule belonged to the Mayans. This age is called as the Classical Period. The Mayan Empire Clear trade routes were formed in the demographics, with each city having its own temple, pyramids, plazas, canals, ball courts, palaces and so forth. The Mayan Creation Myth One of the most important crops that were cultivated locally among the so many other crops is the squash and the beans. Food crop that belonged to the Mayans was maize. Water-dwelling serpents tried almost three times to create the human beings but ended up in failure for the first two attempts. Finally, they succeeded in creating the Mayans. This is the myth of the Mayans. Olama The Mayan civilization is incomparable to many other civilizations of the past. They had their own ball courts, recreational activities and the sports clubs too. Olama is one of the games that they played. As the rings were of different sizes, the complexity of the game is higher when there are changes made in the venues of Mesoamerica. Social Hierarchy Nobles belonged to the top of the social table. They had the power to call the shots and get the lower segments involved in what they want to be. Secret societies were in operation to guide the people and govern their activities all the while. The religion was given due priority and led them towards other achievements. The Decline of the Mayans Craft populations and the artisans, as well as the officials, only led the life of the middle class. Other than that, the social setup either had the working class or the third segments in excessive amounts or the monarchies in the top. That led to the decline of the Mayans as the bottom-level men and women started to rebel against the minority nobles in a short span of time. The Aztecs while there were more theories that were not giving enough evidences towards the decline of the Mayans, the real convincing theory is the heavy pressure on the lower class. Hurricane could have been a reason otherwise, too. The Mayan Empire did not have the biggest of the solutions in hand to face any kind of the catastrophic destructions like the plague, flood, epidemics, drought, warfare, famine and so forth. Finally, the last of the nomadic groups that unfiltered into the Mesoamerica was the Aztecs. They believed that they had closer relations with God. They might have come from Texas or the present Oklahoma. The Upstarts As soon as they arrived in the Mexico region, they gained enough reputation in the domicile as one of the fittest group of warriors. While being admired for their bravery, they were simultaneously hated for their cruel acts too. These Aztecs were hired by the local towns, though. They were hired as mercenaries. Coxcox is the leader from the other tribes. Coxcox means peasant or farmer or the farmer's leader. He started to hire the community of Aztecs as mercenaries. As per the expectations of the Coxcox, the Aztecs was doing the duty pretty well. They never let their boss down. They were fiercely fighting against the enemies and held due respect for Cox Cox. Kulhua is the daughter of Cox Cox. As a token of grated for winning against the enemies, the Aztecs were asking the hand of Cox Cox's daughter later on. It means Kulhua, after marriage, will be taking the throne and be the queen to be regarded with high respect like a goddess. Sacrifice was made later on by the Aztecs with Kulhua. That made Cox Cox to take revenge of the Aztecs. He sent an army to make the Aztecs get scattered here and there. Later, they got settled in the banks of the lake Texcoco. This was chosen for the sole reason that the Aztecs got a strange message. An omen appeared with the eagle perched on a cactus plant. The eagle had a serpent on its beak. Anyone can see the same to be drawn in the coat of arms for Mexico. Anyone can see that in the Mexican flag as well. They called the place as Tenochtitlan. The Aztec Social Hierarchy 
high priests and the royal emperors ranked number one in the social setup. Military officials and the judges were in the equivalent grade. Tax collectors had a place in the creamy lair as well. Common tradition of eldest son taking the responsibility to become a king is not there in the Aztec communities. That is because there can be as many wives for any king. Only a legitimate wife is allowed per ruler, while there can be even hundreds of illegitimate wives. There are kings who had more than 1,000 wives, too. Nobility Scholars and the real wise people belong to these groups. Only a few people were able to serve this class as intellectual few in the society. Others formed the intermediate groups and the lower order commoners. High status, not nobility. This segment ranked number two, but only meagre in their populace. There were really skilled fighters, jests and artisans in the community. The number of commoners was more, though. Commoners 90% of the population is purely commoners. They were serving the same community for the simple reason that they were able to get enough security from the royals and the nobles only then. Taxes were mandatory to be paid to the nobles regularly for the sake of protecting the life of the commons. Slaves Slaves had no rights or hereditary assets or properties. They are the lowest of the social setup, yet the slaves were given the liberty to marry any free person. Rich gamblers can actually bet the slaves in any wage. Manpower, buying and selling was one of the richest trades during those days, not only in the Mesoamerica, but also in many other parts of the world. Human trafficking by the secret sanities rally left to the downfall of biggest of the empires all over the world and the Aztecs wore not any exception to that fact. Heroes and History Cuauhtemo, in the 15th century, is one of the great Aztec emperors, 1520-21. to 21. He came to throne just at the age of 18. Spaniard invasions were at its peak at that point of time. The capital was besieged by the Spaniards. Aztec treasure was the target of the Spaniards. Aztec was captured while crossing the lake Texcoco and tortured bad to reveal the secret of the treasure. There was not any treasure left out as such. It was already taken to the Honduras by that time. Benito Juarez of 19th century was the key personality to fight against the French occupation and held the presidential role for more than five terms. Miguel Hidalgo is a priest who was the key reason to start the War of Independence and also successfully executed the proceedings of the war. Emiliano Zapata Salazar was a coolie of Indian and European races who fought for land as well as independence. Just being a small landholder, he fought bravely against the Diaz's land reforms and actively participated in the revolutions of independence. The Zapatistas was formed by him, which is mainly poor peasants' association that wish to send most of their efforts and time towards working their land and produce an income. Benito Juarez's suggestions for world peace Bringing in big economic reforms or doing some kind of magic in the minds of worse politicians is not the need of the hour to make the world a better place to live. It is anyone that has to change in the first place for the effective changes to fall in line. Everyone of anyone should bring in the changes in you for the world to become a paradise in fact. Some of the qualities that are to be inculcated without fail in order to achieve the objective without any big strain are listed below. Do not worry too much for anything. Smile as much as you can and when possible. Reveal your love to the others. Challenging the fears of yours is paramount. Need to be far more assertive. Reciprocate your gratitude to the society. Help others. Be a good listener. Face yourselves boldly and openly. Accept yourselves completely. How many of us are doing all of these things already? Just imagine about Mother Teresa and her noble services for a moment. If not, imagine so many such selfless leaders of the world that anyone is inspired about. If not to that extent, just try to follow the above list of things to be accomplished in you. Anyone can change anyone and world changes on the whole when every individual does the same. Benito Juarez instilled equality. 
inequality existing in the society is the basic root cause to the issues. Selfishness and avarice has led the human society to the present miserable plight to be in the verge of a third world war. People should awake at this very right moment. Change could be brought in imminently when everyone becomes aware of the simple fact that man is a social animal and he has to live in groups for him to last longer without extinction. Moreover, one cannot sustain in this material world in too much luxury for a prolonged period of time, even under ideal conditions of financial security and safety, as his own physical structure will not permit it over a period of time, though. There is a breaking stress for tolerance. Changes in the social settings Benito Juarez believed in the insanity of the commons as inevitable. Security and safety is the prime duty of the overruling parties. Ignorance prevails among majority of the communities far and wide. People should be enlightened and taught about the practical facts about social life as well as individual or personal life too. Education and knowledge of the real kind can only bring in effective changes in the minds of all. When anyone follows the list mentioned above, anyone is developing into an individual that is ready to create a paradise in the earth for everyone to rejoice together. When anyone ideally realizes that, then it is not an arduous task to accomplish. It is in fact an interesting way of spending your life with a definite purpose added on to it. It makes your existence complete and it is a sole satisfaction which could keep anyone happier all the time. Money alone cannot yield happiness by any means, and people should start to realize these fundamental aspects of life and act accordingly. Historical Significant Port of Veracruz Benito Juarez and his men used the port of Veracruz towards developing the international trade relations. New weapons were brought into the Mexican domicile through the ports. There are important landmarks in and around Transportation facilities were channelized further inland, promoting trade relations. Today, the place is a hot spot. Veracruz rentals properties are of a wide range. Depending upon the tastes of the tourist guests and the budget constraints, a wide range of properties could be located all around this locality. When there is higher comfort levels, the costs are equally higher as well. The amount of money paid toward the lease could vary significantly from one property to that of the other. It depends a lot upon the particular area and locality. Generally speaking, most of the Veracruz rentals properties out here are quite convenient and comfortable for a family to dwell for weeks together. One can enjoy the wonderful climatic conditions and the natural beauty of the place. It is for these two reasons most visitors find it comfortable to visit this part of the world quite repeatedly. There are guests that lease the properties for months together. Veracruz rentals are chosen to be the best choices for corporate rewards. Companies lease some of these properties and do allow their guests to enjoy the occasion to the best. Business managers on successful completion of noteworthy tasks are awarded with such fabulous gifts of free stay in this exotic location. Winners and Losers in Illegal Immigration People from Honduras and Haiti kept coming and seeing the huge potential in Mexico since centuries before. There were not any stringent measures during those days to identify the potential infiltrates. They found homes easily to get settled in and around the Mexican ports. Veracruz rentals are available for daily, weekly as well as monthly rents too. When a person takes a villa or a guest house for a monthly rent, then there will be a lot of advantage. The costs would be far lower in that way. If it is just for a day or two, then it would be at least 10 to 20% of the charges for the whole month. Weekly rents might be a bit reasonable though. Booking in advance for your Veracruz rentals is a great idea. When anyone is planning to move to this locality for the next season, then it is intelligent to get your bookings done well in advance. Either it be the lodging or even the flight tickets, there is a lot of advantage while booking in advance. Enormous amount of costs could be minimized. Moreover, during season time, getting a vacant room is quite difficult even in the cottages of lesser costs. It is such a place of extravagant luxury and extremely nice and romantic climatic conditions. 
Young couples love to spend their honeymoon in places like this in all privacy to enjoy to the core. The nightlife in some of the resorts out here by the Bay region is splendid and people repeatedly do visit these places as and when they get time to spend. Most of the properties will have a swimming pool, heater, air conditioner and so on. Haiti and Colombia from Colombia, Honduras and Haiti, or Puerto Rico's narco-trafficking to Mexico and in turn to USA is not just recent but dates back to centuries now. The measures to counter trafficking are there by the local governments, but still there is not full curb. Catastrophes lead to disaster on the other side quite regularly. In case of any hurricane expected during the book Days of Journey, the whole of the money is completely refunded to the guests. During hurricane, whole of the island is completely evacuated. Still, if the forecasted landfall of the hurricane is in this particular locality, then only refunds could be expected. It is not for all those hurricanes that pass away through the Gulf of Mexico. Reservations could be made to the Paradise Island villas and guest houses or resorts of a phone itself. Most of the properties have their own websites and all the contact details and procedures of booking could be found from the respective web pages. There are possibilities of online booking as well. Most of the current reservations are being done online due to the extreme ease and comfort in doing so. Usually it is customary for the owners here to charge a night rent as advance in order to hold the property. It is just similar to booking tickets for a movie or a train by paying some money in advance. The money will be deducted while checking in. If the booking is cancelled, part of the money or none will be refunded. The rules vary from one place to the other. Usually, if the cancellation is done well ahead of a month, then the refund could be expected. In case of very large resorts, it could be even 60 days period. Having said that, one can understand how earlier the bookings has to be done to get the favourite choices of villas and rooms. It is important to inquire about the number of people that are possibly allowed to stay in a villa. Every house is usually enlisted with the maximum number of people permitted. Usually, every duplex room is allotted to a couple of persons. Four persons could possibly sleep in double bunk beds. The maximum occupancy in a property is strictly monitored and governed by the owners. Most of the villa owners insist the customers to pay as security deposits that are refundable. The terms and conditions related to this particular payment are given in detail in the bill as well as prospectus that are issued at the time of booking. If there is any damage or repair caused to the belongings of the house, then there will be deduction done from the security deposit amount. The management staff will thoroughly inspect the whole of the property just after the checkout is done. Any malfunctioning of air conditioner, heater, television, microwave or any other equipments and devices will be reported to the owner. It is essential to deal with everything carefully. In case of willing to bring pets of different kind, then suitable properties should alone be selected. Pet-friendly villas are separately available. There will be nominal charges for the pets that are brought. It could vary from somewhere between $30 to $150 per pet. Again, it depends upon the standards of the guest house that one chooses to book. Life in Veracruz rentals is lavish and dearer as well. Most of the guests do not mind the extravagant cost of living as it is a sojourn for comfort. Prices vary by far from season to season. There are villas where anyone can find more than a couple of price lists for the same rooms during different periods of a year. The Profiriato and the Regime of Diaz President had the big power in his hands. It was the revolution that united the people of Mexico to protest against the monarchs and get liberty as one unit together. When they united, the enemies had no other choices but to fly away from the country. Both the French and the Spanish colonies disappeared in no time after the revolution. Foreign Investment in Mexico Some positives of the Porfiriato are the artisans. Handicrafts were superior and so does the handmade Mexican hats. Cowboy hats from Mexico were world famous. Quality superior and incomparable in standards. European clients for the cowboy hats from Mexico and the Texas region of the USA are on hot demand. Yet the original Mexican hats were of more value. 
even to major other parts of Americas, the Mexican hats were exported. Mexican style hats are worn both for protection as well as style too. Whatever might be the purpose of using a hat on our head, anyone will always have to maintain it clean and tidy enough. An unclean hat is of no good looks and also can cause potential health hazards like skin irritation, nausea or headache, etc. So in order to keep it always look new and good, anyone needs to maintain them properly with certain hat accessories specially made for that care. Let us see in detail about these hat accessories below. There are specially made cushion available in the market for cleaning the felt hats. Anyone can ask it as felt hat cushion from the hatter. These are for dry brushing your hats on a daily basis so that they do look as new as ever. A lot of things get changed on to the hat fabric when anyone travels a lot wearing that. All the dust and dirt from the surface of the felt hat inclusive of even oily substance are cleanly nipped off with the help of this cushion. Rain and Stain Cover Only two types of hats are in need of this rain and stain cover hat accessory basically. A number of ordinary hats does lose colour and gets faded away eventually after their usage for a year or a couple. Rain and stain cover is not suitable to work in this category of the hats. When anyone uses it on these without knowledge, the colour would fade away much faster than the normal. So when anyone is going to use this cover on your hat, anyone needs to do a small sample test. Take a minute quantity of the rain and stain cover in a brush and just rub it on the inner side of the hats in some remote corner to find out if anyone loses colour. If the colour of hat sticks on to the brush, do not use the rain and stain cover. This could be identified when anyone dips the brush in a 2-3 drops of water to notice the colour instantly. If anyone cannot see any colour dispersion, then it is good to be used in your hat as an effective waterproof agent. A pact between neighbours USA and the Mexico, just like Canada and USA, had some pacts and agreements in between since way long time now. Just like how the Niagara borders are discreet between the two countries. But Tulco Bay is exclusive rights of the Mexicans, even after the success of the Americans in the wars fought since then. Huatulco Bay, paradise underneath the blue waters. Oahu Island is quite prominent enough for the rest of the world as the best tourist spot in the whole of Hawaii. It is just about nine miles from the Waikiki. It is called as the Huatulco Bay, where anyone sees the snorkeling paradise here. Anyone do not have to be a pro in snorkeling to jump in. Anyone can just catch up with anyone that is well experienced in business in just a few minutes of time when anyone gets used to the snorkeling equipment amidst travelling like a fish in water. Order, progress, as well as the scientificos. Imagine if anyone were a fish to be able to travel as far as anyone could down deep into the blue seas. It could be an amazing experience to put you in the shoes of an aquatic animal or a bird that flies in the sky. Anyone can experience the fishes and tortoise life here in the snorkeling paradise. Anyone can go to the depths of the ocean to mingle with the aquatic life. It is the safest part of the world where snorkeling brings anyone no harm at all. Predators cannot dare to enter into this part of the ocean at all. There is complete security for the tortoises as they are being continuously watched from upstairs by the life-saving experts in case of any immediate assistance or rescue needed. If anyone is snorkeling along with your kids, anyone got to be very careful on seeing their comfort too in special. A new era in Mexican history Focus got shifted from invasions, dominations and warfare towards music, arts and recreational activities as a must in the society. Learning and development to catch up with technology became instrumental needs and priorities for the local residents. Visitors are flooring in to see the beauty of the wonderful attractions in Mexico. Huatulco Bay is actually tucked inside the good old volcanic crater which opens up to the huge Pacific Ocean. It is a sparkling bay in the shape of a crescent which encompasses a lot of marine environment in it. Anyone will see a whole lot of marine life to pass by your side when anyone is doing your snorkeling in the blue waters of the Hanoma Bay. The turquoise bay is the home of hundreds of different species of fish that anyone could have ever seen in all your lifetime. 
Anyone can peep through your mask of the snorkeling equipment when anyone travels underneath the water surface like a real fish. Sea turtles, living coral reef, so many underwater passageways that anyone can explore and many more in the Huatulco Bay makes it to be a stunning as well as fascinating aquatic environment altogether. Stay close to the shore area if anyone is not that experienced in the snorkeling yet. Huatulco Bay safety. Read about all the facts and details of marine life here, Huatulco Bay information. Deal with the wild, living reef program. A close reef check with executing scuba diving and the Huatulco Bay marine life are wonders. One of the very famous renowned tourist attractions globally is the Hawaii Islands. The growth rate of Hawaii Islands after independence from the colonial rule to as of today is just magnanimous and can be compared to the development of Japan after the Second World War destruction of Hiroshima and Nagasaki. Sophisticated country in the Asian subcontinent is a commercial leader as well as a place of luxury and enjoyment with so many ultra-extravagant lavish resorts available for tourist attraction with a variety of pigmentation young girls to entertain. The Hawaii Islands airfare from any part of the world is not so high just because of the availability of too many carriers in that route. Let us see much more details about the further down. Hawaii Islands airfare is comparatively cheaper when compared to many other tourist destinations and this is not only because of the route flexibility but also the governmental norms which has given a lot of relaxation for the majority of the airlines in the tax levies so that the costs are controlled at check so as to enhance the tourist attraction. When the number of tourists visiting the place raises the income generated out of the tourists in more than few hundred means is a have to profit for the government. In order to develop this, on a good note, they keep on constructing fabulous places to visit in Hawaii Islands for the tourists when they do visit Hawaii Islands, whether it is a family or single store, anyone can make merry out there with variety of places to entertain you. Hawaii Islands airfare being minimal in this way becomes advantage for the labour category in the neighbouring countries far and wide, including India, from where major population of Hawaii Islands has come from. The cost of visit visas, along with the Hawaii Islands airfare, becomes a nominal affordable cost package for these people to visit the place on tourist visas and try out their luck of getting a contractual offer. Services around the clock, either it is domestic or the international flights from different parts of the globe. It is approximately getting connected to 150 different destinations all over the world, right from here through air route, through different airlines. Battle for Chapultepec Castle Americans were greedy enough to start their invasion plans against Mexico in the year 1847. The castle stood for protecting the Mexicans who are highly injured in the battle. Port of Veracruz was captured in the month of March. Chapultepec Castle – Historical Facts That Surmise Us All Chapultepec Castle is an ancient monumental artifact that stands tall robustly in the 21st century too in the foot of the mountains called Beiwu by the Chuangpi Oceanside. Chapultepec Castle is not just made for architectural beauty. It is a great defensive fort from the coastal side from the Hyman Empire during the period of the Opium War. Along with two more forts, the Chapultepec Castle forms a shape of land pyramid to be a solid obstacle for any infiltrates. River flows from across the length and quite narrowly too. The Mexican-American War Anyone can see the spills that connected with the iron chains just between these forts. This is a deliberate constructional beauty that is a defensive measure to prevent any of the rivalry ship from navigating inside their dominion. Altogether, anyone can see about 40 cannons out there in the right locations where any foreigner could easily locate it. Assaults will be ubiquitous in that way for the enemy to panic and run away from the place. Such a great defensive Chapultepec castle is a tourist spot today for the people from all over the world to look and wonder about its amazing special features. Anyone can see the ancient Chinese writings in the walls and the symbols that do represent their culture heritage and true stories of the past, too. 
These legends are actually the morale boosters for the modern-day Chinese youngsters to believe in themselves in whatever they do and to fight with a lot of determination to achieve in their goals successfully. The robustness of the Chapultepec castle portrays the strong willpower and the determination of the ancient Chinese men who just belong to the weakest Mongolian race, physique-wise. The strongest Negro race is the dominant gene in the whole world, physique-wise, according to the genetic combination. There is not any biased opinion in these logical proven evidential facts, though. These are facts of nature that ever one of us has to accept. On the other hand, the intellectual capacity of the human races cannot be judged on a common basis, though. It is purely dependent upon the individual and it differs by far from one person to the other. Chinese-Mongolian race dominates the Asian subcontinent by far, with so much people inhabiting almost all over the Far East. Thailand, Singapore, Philippines, Malaysia, Hong Kong, Bangkok and so on, everywhere anyone could see the Chinese people ruling the world by all means. Chapultepec Castle is not just the only attraction that anyone can see here in this part of the world. There are better attractions too. Guang Tianpei, along with his fellow men, fought against the enemy in this part of the world. Chapultepec Castle protected them from the enemies in that way. Some of the Chinese deserts, soups and sauces are of medicinal value too. At the end of the day, anyone needs to see to that anyone are striking a proper balance in the ration of proteins, carbohydrates and fats that anyone assimilate in your body. When anyone are aware of these fundamentals and also do keep a conscious control in what anyone intakes, then anyone leads a healthier life altogether. Healthy skin is naturally a byproduct of such an organized lifestyle. In and around this region of Hyman, Wei Yuan Fort, anyone can find a lot of rarest herbs. Indigofera tinctoria indigo is the botanical name of the plant from which anyone gets the black henna. Similarly, there are also green plant powders of two other kinds. There are red henna and the neutral henna. The smell of the neutral henna would resemble freshly cut grass. The anthraquinone present in the neutral henna is quite effective. It is called as the chrysophanic acid. It is one of the noteworthy antifungal as well as antimicrobial agents that are found so far. It works well against the action of bacteria too. It can turn the greyish hair to about pale yellow colour. Damaged hair could be repaired and the individual that uses the neutral henna would get a complete glossy and healthy hair altogether. Similarly, there is plenty of meritorious facts medicine-wise when anyone researches a lot in this drunk bee ocean side, where you unfold and hymen. One better example for this is the red henna found in abundance in Chapultepec Castle surroundings. Red henna is something that would smell similar to the common hay. The leaves of this particular type of red henna do pose the red-orange dye molecules. It is why anyone could get that red-orange stain in the hair for quite a long time even after removing the hair mask of red henna. It is possible to get a heavy, thicker and silky hair when anyone uses this type of henna regularly. Black henna is one another green powder that would smell similar to the cold peas. Chapultepec Castle has so many impressive features that could be listed extensively in that way. The Constructive Phases of the Revolution Changes after the World War II were intense. The best part about the religion is that the channelizing is done by the religion to choose the right steps. Right steps taken in the right time led to the other achievements. Record year for the investments made in Mexican commercial and admin or office spaces has to be noted with keen attention here in the Mexican cities. The numbers are about three times more than what people witnessed in the year 2013 as per the reports came in from the Mexican daily, the El Mundo. Certainly, it is one promising positive sign that is developing in the Mexican property market as a whole. Almost two-thirds of the overall investments come from the global investors outside Spain, which is about 64% as per the reports received from GLL, one leading local property consultancy. When anyone discreet the investors by nationality, the British investors rang just next to the locals. 
Mexican investors contribute to about 36% of the overall investments made. British investors make up to 17% approximately. Investors from Switzerland and Andorra, as well as from Mexico, do contribute to 14, 10 and 9% respectively. Economical backlash Counting on the deals made, the largest procurement of the office spaces was a posh portfolio of buildings that belonged to the regional government of Catalan. About 32% of the overall investments were done by the local nationals. U.S. investments follow closely with 31%, while investments from France are about 18% as a whole. Positive growth Coming to the retail sector, massive purchase done for the year was the deal made with the Clemperer by the Carrefour property for about 400 million euros. Second biggest deal is the acquisition of the Maronade City shopping centres located at a Corona by the Sakami Merlin properties. The deal was cut down for 261 million euros. One more noteworthy deal is the sales of the Isla Azul shopping centres of Madrid purchased by TIAA Henderson, an emerging investments firm. The transaction was done for about 229 million euros. Optimism and massive deals in the Mexican commercial and office spaces markets all goes well for the country's economy, which will bring in a positive impact surely on the Mexican residential market too, in due course of time. From the Mayans and the Aztecs of the ancient ages to the Diaz-like autocrats of the later years, Mexican ancestors have seen the worst and best of the times under diverse circumstances. The native Indians and the nomads did not rule the place for long time for the luxurious lifestyle of the rules, in the upper class was heavier for the lower commoners. Revolutions against the Spanish and the French, seeing the American Revolution paved way for its liberty and economical prospects. When that was challenged once again by the American invasions, the unified Mexicans proved their majority as strength to remain as one of the established economies of the world.